Hey everybody, welcome back to the Ghost Love Music and Cooking. I'm Lola the Ghost Ghostum, and please, please say hello to my beautiful first lady. Hello. Yes, we're here waiting on 2023 to come in and just have a great time. And uh, we really thank thank you guys for uh, going on YouTube and Facebook and sharing and uh, and 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 going on there and just. Help on the side. We got a lot of gigs for the Great Expectation Band coming in because of you guys. And all you got to do is go to Lola the Ghost Ghosting on YouTube and subscribe and like and share or whatever. And then go to GhostersMusicians.com and hire the Great Expectation Band for your wedding and parties. And believe me, you have helped us so much coming up in 2023. The band's got gigs all over the place. Thank you guys. Anyway... I'm going to tell you something about my season in here. Uh, I don't measure, uh, you know this, I don't do all that. This is what I do. I don't measure a thing. When I cook, I just sprinkle a little bit of this and a little bit of that until I hear my mama whisper, that's enough, Lola. And then I'm done with it. Done with it. Done with it. But that's the way we do it here. Okay, so let me tell you about some of the seasons that I use. Uh, I use some garlic. I went light. Complete season, best season in the world. That Holland white cooking wine, black pepper, Morton salt, and uh, the apple cider vinegar. I use it on my greens. Yes. So the first lady made the cornbread. She used this uh, brand here. I don't know what the name is. I can't say it. I'm not going to try it. But she makes it cornbread, she makes it real good. She put cheese and different kind of stuff in there. She won't tell me exactly what she put in there, but it's really, really good. So, uh, I'm gonna tell you another thing I use. I use this ham seasoning here in my, in my greens and my meats and whatever. And it's really good. I'll let you know that. If anybody wanna know, just hit me up and let me let you know. Okay, now check this out, ladies and gentlemen. Check out my, just my apron here. Check it out. Check it out. My army buddy from Ripley, Tennessee, Mr. Larry Pearson, sent this to me. And, and guess what? He put my name on it. Lolan. He put my name on it. And I'll tell you what, Larry. I really, I really do uh, appreciate you, do, you appreciate you doing that, Larry. I mean, Larry's an old army buddy from back in Germany. We met back in 1979. Him and his wife, Marsha, and his grandsons and his daughter Camry, they all take care of the Ghostons and the Ghostons take care of the Pearsons. And I think that's what life's supposed to be, especially coming up in 2023. But we got the cornbread. Here we go over here to the ham. Got the ham. I got some peppers and stuff in there. Oh, that sliced ham. Oh, God, it's wonderful. Okay, here, here's my neck bones. Oh, my God. Got some neck bones. Then I've got some black-eyed peas. This is an old Georgia ghost and tradition that I'm doing here. Well, we do this every year. And here's my hand hocks. Yes, that's beautiful, beautiful. And now look at here. Look at these beautiful greens. I got some smoked turkey necks in there. And some of that seasoning. Larry, Larry sent me from Ripley, Tennessee. I got some of that meat in there. Oh, it's unbelievable. It, <laughs> It makes you want to cry. I, I don't want to cry with y'all. Oh, oh, it's going to be, it's going to be, it's going to be hard. But here's the, here's, here's the, the, the ending recipe. Here it is. I got my ham hock and the neck bone, black eyed peas, oh, greens, ham, and cornbread. All of that's gonna. This is this is what the ghosters do on the on the New Year's, and we got New Year 2023 coming up here. I'm gonna make some changes, ladies and gentlemen. I want you to listen to me. Uh, the first lady has been running down my throat and running up a whole lot of places with a, a like a torch and a flashlight on me. Oh, she's on me. And said, "You gotta change. You gotta change stuff." Messing around and you know and don't listen to what she said. That's what she's saying. <laughs> but anyway, <laughs> don't tell her that. But anyway, <laughs> she might hear it. But anyway, I'm gonna 
might surprise some of you guys. I don't know. Just making some changes. If you see me out there in the street messing around or whatever, I want you to correct me, but I'm pretty sure you want because making a big change in here, 2023. And I hope some of you guys are too, probably. Are you making a lot of changes or whatever? But anyway, if you, you know, you got to have some resolutions, I guess. But anyway, that's what we do. But I tell you what, I can, I can, I can better explain it to you in, in another way, if you don't mind. And I can just do it just like that. And just like that, I'm back. Check out the new me, ladies and gentlemen. You like it? It's kind of on cloud nine. So if you see me doing wrong out there, check me. But instead of me just talking about it, let me tell you what really happened. This story. I'm cuckoo. Put your hand together, y'all. A lady that I know, she came from Columbia. She smiled because I did not understand. Then she gave me a bag of marijuana. She said it was the best in all the land. Can you smell it? And I said, no, 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 I don't smoke it no more. I'm tired of waking up on the floor. No, thank you, please. It only makes me sneeze. Then it makes it hard to find a door. Oh, yeah. A woman that I know, she came from Boca, Spain. She smiled because I did not understand. Then she gave me a 10 pound bag of cocaine. She said it was the best in all the land. And I said, no, 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 I don't. No more. I'm tired of waking up on the floor. No, thank you, please. It only makes me sneeze. Then it makes it hard to find the door. Come on, y'all. Somebody help me, please. Come on, 2023. I can hear them demons. I can't hear you. I can't hear you. Okay. Okay. Bye.